Hi everyone, this is Chicho. Welcome to my channel. Now what we're going to do in this video is do a, sort of a quick little update just to let you know where we are right now with the content being created and what the plans are and where we're going. Okay, and we will do this either quarterly, semi-annually or on a yearly basis. And if you do have questions, anything that you want me to include in these updates, please post comments in the this in in these videos once they're uploaded to BitChute or YouTube and I'll add them on as categories that we'll cover in the next update okay as far as uh, what I wanted to cover the first thing I wanted to do is uh, thank everyone that's been supporting this work okay the reason we're here right now is because of you what's going to see us into the future and the different things we have planned out to roll out is going to be because of you so thank you thank you for the support those of you from patreon those of you on twitch youtube those of you who are making direct donations thank you for the love the comments and the words of encouragement really without you we wouldn't be here and with your support we're going to see ourselves into the future and roll out a lot of things that we've been planning on rolling out right build the content slowly and continue to grow the playlists and link everything up through mathematics and looking at data and seeing where it takes us okay so thank you very much for the support really from the bottom of my heart okay the second thing i wanted to mention is basically i started live streaming towards the end of 2017 and what I ended up doing is acquiring a whole bunch of different tools you know a laptop high-end gaming computer mic cameras software so I basically learned how to live stream towards the end of 2017 and we're in the middle of 2018 right now since that time we've basically put out 68 videos and about 89 hours of live streaming right and the uh, 68 videos and the hours of live streaming that we've done we've sort of done a full repertoire we've got, done mathematics we've done food we've done gaming we've done comic books we've done a lot of things that we did before we started live streaming and one of the things i wanted to do and i we are doing right now is basically live streaming the recording sessions I don't think we're gonna live stream every recording session but we are going to live stream a lot of recording sessions and though basically the routine is going to be we're gonna tag team them so we're gonna live stream the recording sessions just to show everyone how I end up creating this content because a lot of times or a lot of questions over the years have come my way asking me how I go about creating this content so I think that's important to share okay so what we're going to do basically the routine is going to be we're going to be live streaming the recording sessions and then i'm going to end up recording the videos and uploading those to whatever platform we're sharing the recorded videos on and then we're going to upload these recording sessions as behind the scenes so i've created a playlist called behind the scenes and behind the scenes is us live streaming recording sessions so when we're live streaming or recording sessions there's going to be basically two videos that are going to have the same sort of content right but after the recording sessions we end up usually usually doing a q a with whoever's watching the live stream and we sort of do a meet and greet before the live streams okay or before the recording sessions so you're welcome to participate in any of these live streams whenever you want and ask questions because there are basically open discussion okay now while i've gone through this it's been a seriously uh you know pretty steep learning curve from my end because i had to learn a lot of this a lot of this technology a lot of this content and a lot of these learn how to interact with these different platforms maybe twitch maybe discord maybe transferring the information to youtube and figuring out how youtube was going to deal with these live streams their algorithms and how they were going to censor some of this information right and there are some censoring there is some censoring going on for sure their algorithms are catching some of the some of the discussion taking place right but as far as i'm concerned it's something we can deal with 
okay as for what this next phase is all about this next phase is basically what we've done in the last three major live streams that we did right we did a live stream behind the scenes of shooting a video of a how-to video right how to study video for ASMR math so there's two videos that we have up right now one of them is the edited version of how to study and the other one is a behind the scenes version where we live streamed the how to study video how to study number seven how to take notes right so if you want to know how that works basically there's two videos you can watch there we did another recording session where it was basically exploring the possibilities of ICOs and cryptocurrencies where we recorded the session and we also live stream the session so again there's another tag team videos where we have the edited version of exploring the possibilities of ICOs and cryptocurrencies and behind the scenes version where we live stream them with some questions that were posed after the recording session and we've done a third stream as well where we did a comic book live stream and we also recorded it right where we did all the valiant buys and there's going to be a tag team video of that as well where we have the edited version of the comic book haul recorded with the lapel mic the sound and the hd camera which gives it a much better asmr feel it goes back to where we were before we introduced live streaming and after that video is uploaded there's a behind the scenes of that recording session on going to be loaded up on the different platforms where we're sharing this information okay so that's where we are in terms of how we're rolling out this live stream and how the the frequency and the type of videos that are being loaded on youtube and bitshoot are going to be uh, coming on right one other update i want to give you guys is um, regarding comic books right now i've had a lot of people ask me if i'm going to go back to doing comic book readings and 100 percent my apologies for not you know staying up with the comic book readings we've planned for comic book reading set number four we've done i forget how many how many we've done i think we've done eight out of 32 or so and we've done a couple of extra ones as well uh, that weren't in reading set number four so we have a whole bunch of videos that we have to do readings for and we want to do readings for for reading set number four because we planned on doing 32 readings right so we've done basically eight out of 32 so we've got another 24 readings to do for reading set number four and we will be doing those this summer i've uh, i mentioned to a couple of people i believe we're going to start that up in august this you know in a couple of months august 2018 or a month i guess right but i might try to slip in a couple of ones random ones in july as well but basically we're going to start doing comic book readings and we're going to live stream the comic book readings basically we're going to have the same type of setup as we had for the how to study video number seven how to take notes where we're going to live stream the readings so if you want to catch a comic book reading being live streamed you definitely want to experience that through twitch because we are going to do that but if you don't that's okay because we are going to be recording with a lapel mic and the hd camera and i will be taking those you know into the software that i use for editing and editing those and that will be more the sound quality will be more um it won't have uh, sort of the sharpness to it when it's going through this instead of being with the stand up the podcasting mic okay so there's two different ways you can uh, enjoy the comic book readings right and there's going to be a lot more stuff that i plan on to do for comic books i do plan on uh, putting up some of my collection on ebay to sell i do plan on um you know basically showing you guys the process of how i go about grading the comic books how i go about putting the stuff on ebay to sell them on ebay and we're definitely going to expand on talk more about what um you know what my uh 
work with comic book publishing was which was basically you know what i did with mermaid publications where we actually talked a little bit about that um, regarding an eye for an eye comic book one of the comic book series that i published and we will talk about the other comic book comic books that i published through mermaid publications and we'll definitely 100 percent will be doing readings for almost you know most likely all of the comic books that i ended up publishing and most likely because people have been asking me um, after we talked about eye for an eye they asked me where they could get the eye for an eye comic i'll definitely load those on to ebay as well and have those up as auction if you feel like you know acquiring those comics as well right and there's a few eye for an eye and some of the comic books that i did through memory publications going to be sent out to uh, uh to you know who you are right to the people who've been supporting me through patreon and some of the people that are working behind the scenes through discord modding through discord and twitch and some of the people who've done direct donations and stuff like this uh, just as a thank you gift okay so there's a lot more coming on regarding comic books uh people have asking me if we're going to do any more food videos 100 percent, we will be doing more food videos 100 percent. the stuff we're going to do in the kitchen most likely is all going to be live streamed i don't think i'm going to do any uh recording sessions when it comes to making food because i do like the double camera angles that we've been using one camera here one camera here one camera straight out these two cameras looking on the stove top where we're doing the cookings and stuff and i think i can only do that with the live streams i'm not set up to do those recording versions right but we will definitely be doing way more food videos and we're definitely going to do more eating videos as well right so there's a lot more content um, for that playlist for that content coming up as well uh, don't worry 100 food is a huge part of my life and we'll definitely share that information okay another thing um, i wanted to mention is people have been asking me uh, to start doing more politics videos because they liked what i've either written in the past over the last i don't know 12 years or so or they like some of the you know the few a handful of videos we put out regarding politics and as i've mentioned we're going to link up the politics stuff through economics so mainly when i'm talking about politics i'm going to enter through the realm of economics right present that information however because a lot of people have been asking me to start doing more political videos what we're going to do and because the world is changing in a big way um, and there are certain things playing out that we need to pay attention to because that's going to affect all of us in terms of economics really personal finance investing and all that jazz right so what i'm going to do uh, because we've been having a lot of requests to do more politics is most likely once a month or once every two months we'll do a live stream open discussion for politics right politics and economics so i'm not going to prepare anything to talk about for those videos i'm just going to be available to give you my perspective regarding certain political events that are taking place maybe local or global okay and what i'll try to do is stay focused on the economics aspect of it because i don't want to introduce my biases uh, to those political discussions but i will try to present my perspective in a way where no matter how extreme the thought process is i sort of want to give both ends of the spectrum because over the years what i've realize regarding politics is there's a reason why certain people have a certain political stance right there's a reason why they lean a certain way right may they be extreme from this end or from that end right and it's really important to understand both perspectives to get a really good idea of what is really taking place and not get caught up 
in the rhetoric and the name calling and basically the BS coming out of corporate news, right? Because we really don't want to vent when it comes to doing political videos, political discussions. We want to understand what's going on and why it's happening. So that's what we'll end up doing in these live stream, open discussion, political, economic um, streams that we're going to do. And uh, just, to, just to continue on that uh, mindset regarding politics and economics, people have been commenting, uh, there's a couple of people that said congratulations on for Canada for legalizing cannabis, right? And it is a huge step towards as Robert Anton Wilson would say coming out of the dark ages right because if you've been following my work basically in 2010 or so or 2009 2010 I threw my hat in into the fray right what I ended up doing was saying that I was going to work towards ending prohibition a certain amount of my energy my resources were going to be put towards trying to help end prohibition Right, and the reason I did this was, if you go to, and basically the method I chose to do this was linking up through mathematics, right? So there's a website called 420math.com. And if you go to the about page, basically in the about page, I explain why it is that I've joined this battle, right? And when I joined this battle, I had a lot of people tell me that I was out of my mind, right? I had a lot of people tell me that there is no way that legalization would come about right and legalization is not the end of prohibition right they're two different things End of prohibition means the government getting out of our business legalization means the government is is forcing themselves into our business right we have a long ways to go yet to end prohibition legalization is the first step this is just one battle there's a lot more to come okay so we have cause to celebrate we do we've come a long way in the last few years but there's a lot of work to be done there's a lot of work to be done okay and I will stay in this in this battle for as long as it takes right and it's gonna take a long time don't uh, we're not there yet okay so that's sort of a quick little update uh, some of the things I wanted to talk about and we will continue to do updates and if there's anything you'd like to talk about in the next update please post comments and I'll include the subject in the next update maybe quarterly semi-annually or yearly updates and I'll look at you know I'll look at the user agreements and YouTube and twitch and all these different platforms to see if I can share some of that information and maybe we'll start sharing some of the analytics of Chicho analytics of what we're doing here with you guys as well and then do the Q&A as a live stream okay so that's about it um, I hope I hope uh, that answers a lot of your questions and I'm definitely looking forward uh, to all the content coming up and I hope you are as well that's it for now. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.